Continuing coverage tonight, recent heavy rain in Savannah brought setbacks to a major road construction project in downtown. This was the scene in Haversham Village Friday. That same rain being blamed for a collapsed trench near the President Street construction. Work on the $30 million President Street project is filling the effects. Crews are working on the creation of new intersections and a canal. They're also raising the road, all to help fix those flooding problems. WJ Sales, Amanda Foster is there now. She has more. Amanda. Well, the project is to protect this area from Mother Nature, but she's not making it easy. Rain has been a major setback to the project that city leaders say is their biggest road project yet. Now the project sets out to prevent flooding in the area, but in the meantime, rain is still a problem. Today, crews are working on installing storm drainage and working on a new canal to drain all of downtown. Now, even though this heavy rainfall has been a setback, there is some good news moving forward. To speed things up, crews are installing additional drains. Now, those are tubes going 40 feet into the ground over the next two months. The project manager says it'll help speed up part of the process that was expected to take the full year and a half. And there are rain delays built into the 30-month, $30 million schedule. We haven't um, made the progress that we've wanted to make because of the rain. But again, those delays are built into the project. Um, so, um, you know, the hope is to make it up. Certainly, if it continues to rain for the rest of the year like it has been over the, over the course of July, we'll, we'll have some scheduling issues that we'll have to address. Now, workers also hit some other delays earlier on, like having to relocate some utility lines and locating an electric line that they didn't know existed. Now, if they use up all of their resources, they will have to file for a change order, and that will be reviewed by the city of Savannah. Now, they say they aren't quite to that point yet, but we will break down this construction and the traffic delays it's causing tonight at 10 and 11. Live in Savannah, I'm Amanda Foster, WJCL 22 News. No doubt drivers will be watching intently. Thanks, Amanda. New at 6, 